It's just when they start oh, to get up and run, that's what I'm afraid. Did you know that or was that an animation? I don't know. 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 I don't I mean, yeah, it's like, it's like they, they, we know we have everything we need to know. Oh, Imagine her answer to the question was actually yeah, that's 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 funny. funny. How do you know? Oh my goodness. Hints, and also, what would be the reason for us to need to get the Mecto 100% True. in the situation if it wasn't going to be used for something that we <laughs> Additionally, she okay. oh, okay. oh, hold up. Wait. You were saying something on my walk off. And then we're gonna do reruns for a little bit. Do you think you would be able to get a three TV if we had to do the painter again? Do you think you'd get me a recording of Crazy's past with a good thing? Your attention, please. The event of the evening is about to begin. Apologies for interrupting your merrymaking. Thing is about to begin. The time will come for that. The time indeed. <laughs> it seems you've met with an uncertain. It's about to begin. You find yourself at an interdimensional crossroads. A rendezvous of travelers between worlds. My name is Sheen. I am a highly metastasized, infomorphic, mimetic meme complex, and one of the tour guides of VR travelers. We create immersive, story-based tours with original writing, beautiful worlds, voice acting, and 100% wholesome team effort. Welcome to the rendezvous, our point of contact to narrative domains. Tonight, we will be telling the story of the pilot. You are welcome to stream and or record this event. Our tours are for free for you and just for fun. Travelers, if you are experiencing lag due to the high number of people tonight at this time, I recommend you turn off avatars for strangers and those you don't know, possibly everyone, depending on the severity of your lag. Kindly, though, keep the avatar of yours truly and my fellow tour guides Trajim and Rendizo turned on. My friends, in just a moment, I will open an Invite Plus portal to the world of the pilot. Please, at this time, make sure you are friends with someone else here, in case you disconnect and need to be invited back in. That's the only like way back, back into the world, is sending an invite re request to a friend that's already there. You are welcome to add us tour guides. Rajim and Rendizo, or myself, to assist with this. We will also be posting a link to the tour world in the Discord should our portal fail. Now then, for those of you standing in front of me, kindly step aside. I will open the gates to the narrative domain. 
in. That's my cue to leave and come back, that, of course. We shall see, Kirby. We shall see. Kirby. <clears throat> Yeah, yeah. Case, 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 Do not yeah, enter like the Kirby. portal. Wait for it to stabilize. You shall not. You're breaking the code. I'll try yeah, again. Not. Just a moment. Exactly. This is why we wait for you to stabilize. Take two. Always best to ensure the portal is locked. He does not want to see the portal. Oh, there's thing actually. And. Oh, no. Back up. Don't try to go in. It's a good thing. This is kind of fun. Kirby, try backing up a little bit. That might help a team to get. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do it. Did you say Yes. That'd be worth a shot. Oh, no. Trajan's fine. I was just saying that I think it's kind of like a first date idea. Give Trajan your powers. Take that should help stabilize the portal. Gosh darn it! No, I'm just gonna get some more time, please. attention, please. My sincere apologies for the inconvenience, but due to those using clients, our portal is likely failing. Worry not, as our backup plan always works. My fellow tour guides and myself will create the instance and we will post a link to the instance in the Discord, which you may click on and it will take you there. You may also send us an invite request. I recommend that you send to Trajim and Rendizo, as they will be a bit faster than I, but I will get to your request after a couple minutes. My friends, I will now go to the instance. Wait for me to load in and start sending your invite request. Yeah, don't pile them on them. Jimothy. Can you, if we all count them down, we all send them all at once. <laughs> and he's just drowned in invite requests. <laughs> Stop it, you already said! Do a new ball. Keep shooting! <laughs> What is going on over so there? What are you maggots oh, doing? Are you sure? Hello. Man, this, is a, this is a great oh, question. Oh, look, I can invite you. <laughs> it's happening a lot lately. Yeah. Yeah. I got the invite. Okay, well, so I'm going to put it on over to you. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my God.
So yeah, fun, Spider. Yeah, two, two <laughs> two I remember. I remember. Hello. Yeah, Hello. Hello. I'm gonna split my hair. Holy shit. Yeah. You must have a very strong grip. There's gotta be. Zoop, hold on. There's a Zoop roadie going here. Yeah, about that. It's like one of those fucking God, like fucking Bronco sick. rides at the state fair. I must hold on. The soup holds on. Never mind. I would have thrown up by now. I'll literally just click on the link. Have. See what's new. What is that? What do you mean, what is this? Udders? What do you mean? What the fuck? Why do you have udders? And uh, what is wrong See, it's, with it's you? A whole, oh it's a yes. whole in joke. It's a whole in joke. Like, uh, the panda got titties. Guys, what the heck? Guys, so I'm having milk today. I can't. Bruh. I think you blue cells my budget in the world. You know, you see something new every day. Yes, I know. Why? A lot of people are grouping Why? around just about the cutter. My mom are like for scientific purposes. We are very scientific humans. I cannot hear you. I said that's great, Luna's mom. Only the most mature actions you left in the company. Keep trying to think. I was used to two eyeballs. This is not the shape I expect to fly like a boomerang. The frick. This is the first time I've been so Gio, I think you mean how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood. Fuck. Oh my god, so If a woodchuck could chuck woodchuck wood, would it? Yes. Would it chuck? Would it chuck chuck? Would it chuck chuck chuck? Did someone say did someone say arson? I'm always down for that. Would it chuck chuck or chuck? No, I I heard I really heard someone say burn down the house. Is the woodchuck made or chuck? Because I'm gonna chuck 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 No, I want to burn stuff now. Wait till you hear about Gustav's good stuff from Gustav's good stuff. Gustav's good stuff. Stuff stuff. I forgot how that one went. Sure it would be a shame if someone lit it on fire. Oh my god, I thought that was a real fucking hole. That's all I got to say about that. I don't remember, what was Halloween or what the... I think this was Halloween, what was it? Yeah. What did you have before? Oh, I thought it was just fine. Oh, yeah, how's your Yu-Gi-Oh thing going on, though? Or have you not worked on it since you last met? So you've seen all the cards I added to it? Which WMR? Uh, I saw the one that you had in the cell, but other than that, I have no one. Super cheap. Let's see. I have no you. Ultimate reversal. I'm the fuck. He's been staying a lot of stars. I'm gonna accidentally tell him. And then we get crazy. Excuse me. We have to back up. Security security Please make your way to Come on, Chief. The world, the story of the pilot. Once again, feel welcome to turn off avatars of those you don't know to decrease lag. At this time, please ensure your world music is turned up, as music is an important part of the story. You should be able to clearly hear the wind.
without further ado, let's begin. Everyone, kindly use the save point behind me. Of course, we're doing the tea pose. Ah, yes, the tea posing. As is tradition, if I can actually get up here, Dan. It would be a shame if someone accidentally <laughs> brought a match. Ah, uh, yeah. first try. <laughs> so I'm looking at really oh, boy, jeez. <laughs> Jay Welkers. You know, is that what the uh, uh, tea posing this time? <laughs> it hurts my arms. Ah, uh, my <laughs> friends. I forgot to mention, as with any tour in the real world, Kindly remain silent during narration. However, please do talk as we walk from place to place. And the story begins. Between the forest and the countryside, there sits a lone house. And in this house is a young girl. Every evening, she looks out of her bedroom window, and her imagination soars. She <clears> wonders <throat> about the faraway, exotic places her father always tells her about. She closes her eyes, and she can see them. Beautiful cities filled with waterfalls and white birds. Majestic mountains capped by clouds so soft one could fall asleep on them. She wonders and she wonders until the sun sets and the crickets fill the air. In her mind, the scene shifts to the front door. She pictures her father finally coming home. She hopes for it with all her heart. It's going to be tonight. She knows it is. Her heart flutters, and she opens her eyes expectantly. The sky is purple, but the path outside is empty. She was wrong. He hasn't come home. She shoves the curtains across, turns from the window, and goes back inside. My friends, let's go inside and see if she's all right. This way. And for the last wow. time, the return of the L Pot. I slammed this oh out of my door. <laughs> There's a lot. Oh. The, the Pot of L. That's gonna be a card. Now. There's a lot. No, no, There's a lot of L. That's where you get this Draw your L's. Get out of here, Green Grunt. Draw your L's. The L Pot, not the Green Grunt Pot. Bring the one more. Hi guys, thanks for coming. Why is this happening? The climb it smells like boys. Better climb just so I can see. We must see. It's so awkward. It's cool we must save my family. Oh, no. Oh, no. The young girl it is trudges I through the dark the house. Too. Okay. The young girl trudges through the dark house. The kitchen is empty. Her mother has forgotten to cook again. The girl grabs an apple from the table, pulls up a chair, and eats alone. She closes her eyes again wanting to go to another place. The image slowly forms in her mind, wisp of mist brushing by, the gentle rush of cool air in her ears, the deep thrum as she passes through clouds, the land far below her, and everything cast in a radiant golden light. Then the sky knocks. No, not the sky. She opens her eyes. Could it be? The chair clatters to the ground and she runs toward the front door. She can't contain her excitement. There he is. He's finally home. She lets out a cry of joy, a bit of sadness, and then her father picks her up and holds her tightly. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, is Mama still sleeping by the radar? Papa's voice is comforting, like the cloud she flew through. Only when you're gone so long. The mother's voice drifts in, warming the room. She joins them in a tight embrace. 
I'll always come back, he says. He takes out a sealed bottle of capsules from his jacket and hands it to the mother. He apologizes for only being able to get enough for ten months. He seems really sad about it. Don't worry, the mother says. I'll manage. I always have. And soon, the house is filled with the warm glow from the fire, the sounds of laughter, the smell of a roast. And the little girl could not possibly be more happy. After dinner, the girl asks her father for another story about the pilot. He looks at her as a smile slowly spreads across his face. My friends, let's all go together and listen to father's story. This way. Oh my gosh, I did it. Little did you know this is a part of... <sighs> Hold up, don't mind me. I'm just gonna... Just gonna take a nap here, guys. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Napping Please, Gio. Gio. Please, Gio. <laughs> Wait, how much did I miss? Praise the cube. Geo, contain Good night, Geo. Sit so tight. You. Don't let the lava bite. No. <laughs> oh shit! I'm on Geo. <laughs> 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 Good night, sweet Good night, sweet You're not my friend. Don't live my life. Was I on your side? The feelings mutual, man. What a glitch. The story continues. The young girl jumps into bed, and the. Father and mother sit either side of her. The father tells another story about his daughter's favorite hero, the pilot. Each time the father would revisit the story, the pilot would be on a new adventure. But each time, a few new themes remain the same. The pilot flies to new worlds with their legendary ship, and wherever they go, they meet new friends who need their help. The odds would be stacked against them. But thanks to their trusty legendary ship, the pilot always saves the day. The girl remains awake till the very end. And then the father asks, as he does at the end of every story. So, <laughs> why do you think the pilot helps people? The young girl squeezes her bunny doll and cheers. Because it's the good thing to do. The mother and father look at one another, smile, and then laugh. The daughter doesn't know what happened, but she laughs with them anyway. As her parents leave the room, the girl asks if, when she grows up, she can fly to other worlds to help people like the pilot. Of course, the father says, you'll be the greatest pilot. And someday, you will save the day, too. The mother turns to look out the window. They tuck her in. The father turns off the light, and they leave the door ajar for their daughter. My friends, let's go back downstairs and let her sleep. This way. Our jar. Oh. This is our jar. jar. That's the kicky pot. Oh, our jar. Plant. I am Russian. <laughs> Anyone want a pot of tea? Plenty of room, Jay. I'm just gonna sit right here. <laughs> it's a pot of hell. Not a pot of tea. I'm called the Elman, not Jay. Are you? Me? Me? Mr. L. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> Again, with the glitch. Sorry, my mic cut out. My ping is very terrible. The mother and father sit together in the living room. She asks him if he did what he set out to do, and if he was tracked. He says the same thing he always says, of course not, he was careful. He starts talking about being able to get away with unregistered flights and is about to go into the tendency for military to turn a blind eye to a, a certain amount of excess carbo, cargo when she stops him with a finger on the lips. She reminds him that she knows all of this already. He laughs and 
reminds her again that she'll know if anything's approaching thanks to the radar he stole. She nods. She knows this already. They both decide it's a topic for another time. Her husband is home again, and she missed him dearly. And so, they go to bed. The mother is woken suddenly. It's the father. He's talking about something on the radar headed for the refugee camp. She rubs her eyes, confused. I have to go, says the father. I have to get them out. She doesn't understand. She pleads for him not to leave again, still not sure what exactly is happening. She suggests that it's just a scout or an error. No, the father says, and his voice frightens her. Look at the radar. The mother looks, and her heart drops. The signal is enormous, the largest airship she's ever seen, and it is headed directly for the rebel camp off the radar's edge. That's... she begins, but her voice falters. Yes, says the father, the dark monument airship. Last time it was deployed, it laid waste to everything from Eternic to the Aquavi Islands. The death toll was in the millions. Fire fell from the sky for weeks after, and to this day, nothing grows there. Hidden forest camps, <clears throat> underground bases, networks under towns, it doesn't matter. Nobody is safe from this thing. Sending it there could only mean... He doesn't finish. He doesn't need to. I'll join you, the mother says. I was an engineer in the military. I can help. You were, until they discharged you for your condition. He takes hold of her shoulders, looks her in the eyes. The moonlight from outside dims and the room goes dark. I need you to stay here. Protect our daughter. The gray soldiers will easily detect her potential. They'll take her away from us. We can't let our daughter become another weapon for them. The mother feels as though she is in a nightmare. Can't you contact the Ethos Coalition for help? The Coalition's resistance ships won't make it in time. I can outrun that. Abomination. I smuggled them into the camp in the first place, so it's up to me to get them out of there. I'm their only hope. His hands slide down her arms, and he takes hold of her fingers. She's trembling. Listen, I was the same as them, a refugee on the run, remember? And then you rescued me. I have to return the favor. It's... And he looks at her. It's the good thing to do. Reluctantly, she nods. He kisses her and rushes out into the night with his things. The house is cold and dark once more, and the mother and daughter are left alone. A year has passed. The father has not returned, and the daughter has just turned six. The mother lost contact with the Ethos Coalition months ago. Every night she waits by the radar, staring at the night sky. Tonight her daughter is with her, and together they watch, wondering if the moon is going to reappear. The silence is broken by the daughter. Mama, are you going to listen to the radio all night again? The mother doesn't answer. Daddy said it's bad for your heart to stay up. The mother looks down at her daughter, smiles, turns off the radar, and holds her for a while. She takes her to bed and promises that she will sleep on time. She closes the door.
The mother goes back to the radar and turns it on. She listens with her head in her arms. She listens until sleep takes her. A loud voice screeches. Attention, attention. This area is under martial law by order of the Grey. Surrender all ether users immediately or face execution. She changes her channels, but it's everywhere. She presses her hands against her ears, but it's in her head. How? Then she looks at the radar, and she sees it. Already over the forest, the cursed ship. Why is it here? No, she doesn't have time to think. They have to escape. The mother rushes upstairs, wakes her daughter, and dresses her. The daughter only has time to grab her bunny doll before a banging sound echoes from the ground floor. The sounds of splintering wood terrify them as they run toward the outside balcony. Quickly, my friends, this way. Hey, has anyone seen my match? I can't find it. My mom's a psycho. I can't find my limbs again when falling off. Geo, stop. Come on, Geo. Try to stop on role playing your shit. Wait, I'm on here. I'm sorry, Geo. I'm sorry, Geo. Come on. Thank you. You know what? I'm gonna fly. Equalization, do I trust you to catch me? Okay, well, the delusion's already in. My friends. <laughs> Quickly, use L man to break your fall, bro. <laughs> <laughs> stuck. I'm stuck. I can't get over the railing. I'm already pulling my place. Jump on the on the barrel. Right over there. Come on, his spine is nice and soft. Stop on the barrel. Yes. <laughs> Let me help you out if you yeah, really can. <laughs> Who are they? cries the little girl. Mama, I'm scared. The mother holds her daughter tight and jumps from the balcony. She hits the ground hard, landing on her side. A sharp pain shoots through a broken rib, but her daughter is safe, and that's all that matters. She stands and looks. The entire forest is in flames. There, a path through the walls of fire. It's the only way. My friends, this way. Wake up! Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Yo, I'm gonna jump in it. This shit toasty. Do you think they'll roast marshmallows? Yeah, can I roast uh, I mean, like, maybe. But yeah, it's not like much closer than last time. I may, I may or may not have lost my mask and I may or may not have committed arson just now. Is it being closer? What do you Definitely looks close. My friends, yeah. The dark monument. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she struggles to run. Her daughter is heavy. She glances over her shoulder. Dark figures are circling the house, peering through the clouds of smoke. Then the mother looks up, and she sees it. A horrifying shape eclipses the moon. Its silhouette drops a blanket of slow-moving shadow, and it smothers the land below in darkness. The airship creeps slowly, unstoppably, toward them. She places her daughter on her feet, kneels to look her in the eyes. Mama is going to run, and you must run too. She barely manages to get the words out. You must not let go of my hand. Do you understand? Do not let go. Is that a monster? The little girl stammers, with eyes welling up. No, do not look at it, the mother cries. Take my hand, and don't let go. One of the soldiers yells in the distance. The mother grips her hand tight, and they run. Her heart is racing, the fire is unbearably hot, and the smoke scrapes in her throat. My friends, the mother and daughter have been spotted, and are now pursued by the Dark Monument. Together, they must find a way through the burning forest, and so must all of you, as this is your first quest. Click the pressure save point, and as fast as you can, run for their lives. So, and don't get... Follow the mouse, follow the mouse.
Follow the shit. I like Chris. 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 Music for the situation, but I loved it all the same. Initial D, not work, yes. Tiny size can't see! Perfect round! How about through the fire and flames? Hello. Protect the next time we do the pilot. Don't tell me. Oh, we're gonna do that. The first time I got caught on accident, and you get this weird pop up in your face. I'm cozy. I got blankets all over me. So, if I do fall asleep, it will hopefully be in the after party. I hunger, celery stick. After after party. No, you can't right now because <laughs> I don't want to risk crashing again. I just want to converse with everyone without me crashing. Someone bypass my I can hide both my avatar. It's not even a fallback or anything else is shown. And I can see some robot tools. All the others are gone. Look at him. Alright, now we finally got a little bit of it and everything could be fine again. Yes. I'm just gonna reattach this. There we go. I mean, 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 Oh, dude. So... Did someone just whisper Tater in, like, in my hand? I'm not a trampoline man or a goomba. No. I mean, I if somebody has, I really want some Tater Toss. I wouldn't, wouldn't say no to them. Right? I'm a chicken nugget type of fancy hole. I'm wrong. I don't like Tater Toss. Get the best of both worlds. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, boom. You got your dinner and your side. Hey. Why am I going to have dinner and side when I have an entire snack right here? Uh, I forgot to mention, but uh, no plate three. Me. I know. I'm 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 like I'm like Mia Inky and Mia, my beloved. Two words, two words. Mia, no, you started a war because they are having a pretty bad. You were the lactose person strength. Congratulations. People still start with it. Pebble smells like milk. It's it's can of milk. Please do not smell me. Horrible. You're too strict. You smell like cheese. Oh my god. Do not smell me. You smell like cheese. Why do you smell like cheese? I'm so sorry, Pebble. That is truly my bad. This is your worst. 
Hey guys, it's National Smell Pebble Day. That's like totally just committed a war crime. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 We need salt. We can have better. We can have Captain Panda. We have plenty of meat in the fire. We can't cook him. No, get off. No, get off. No, get off. Yes. No, no, this is my campfire. Put him in. Come on. Come on. No, hey, hey, hey. Put him in. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Who does that? And I definitely get the vibes, the energy. Story time! Our Yay. house flooded, so we're like using the My upstairs. Friends. So I drive. So we so have to do that the stairs every day. Oh, really? But I don't crash. I mean, a little silver lining, you know? We have made it somehow. Guys, we're continuing. We're continuing, guys. Guys, we're continuing. Well, they're dying back this year. A few deaths on a tour is normal. My friends, we have made it here somehow. <laughs> Everyone, please walk this way. Don't do it. Oh, God. Oh, God. I like the fact that they're the majority, they're like a good one. This is just 2D characters, I love it. Innocent! Hold on, Hold on. I heard a gurgle there, is someone okay? Yo, it's warm! Come here, Nico! It's a seizure, are you? Unfortunately, Kiwi can miss through the matter in your world. So it's not exactly swimming, just sort of hopelessly floating. That's fucked up. Hold up, hold up. That's pretty much swimming hey, in my experience. You're saying you need a pool <laughs> This is a rare sea Anyone creature right here. I wish I was a pool floaty. Nah, I'm good. I wish I was a pool floaty. That could be a rare My friends. I promise you. What? The story continues. something, I don't know. Travelers, your attention please. I beg of your silence, dearest friends. The mother and father stagger into a secluded clearing. Nearby is a tent, an old campfire, and a pond. Raindrops pat against the canvas, the leaves of the trees, and the water's surface. The ground squelches beneath every footstep. The rain is cold, but the chill soothes the mother's burns. They won't have to worry about the fire spreading this far. Inside the tent, the mother speaks words of comfort to her wailing child, cradling her in her arms. The traumatized girl grips her bunny and buries her face into the mother. The rain masks her tears, and she soon sleeps. The mother, however, does not and keeps watch all through the stormy night. When the last of the daughter's sniffles subside, she begins to dream of a faraway place, a dark place. She descends into a nightmare. My friends, please use the nightmare save point. This will be fun. Damn, someone's fucking dead! Oh, this isn't a fucking nice.
You are gonna lag to hell in this one. It took a long time for that thing to fucking be to be visible. So this is the part where you're gonna wanna. Wait, your party is alive and trails of cold steel and. My friends, listen carefully. The story continues. Tonight's NPCs, please come forward. Stand next to me and change into your searchlight avatar. Uh. NPCs, please turn on your searchlights and show them to the group. My friends, tonight's NPCs are Equalization and the L-Man. At this time, please enable the avatars of Whoa. Equalization and the L-Man. You should be able to see their shining searchlights. After this, we get to sing the campfire Everyone. song. <laughs> the story continues. My friends, a figure is suddenly aware of their surroundings. The walls are cold and slick. The floor is a solid void. And the air shimmers with a shadowy haze. The unknown figure looks about, barely able to see anything. What am I doing here? I was searching for something. They think these thoughts in silence. But there are voices audible in the distance, echoing and distorted, drawling closer. The figure realizes they can't stay here. They must find a way out. And so must all of you, as this is your next quest. Listen carefully. Search for a way through the darkness and avoid these monsters and their searchlights at all cost. Getting caught in a monster's cone of light will fracture the girl's hope, and you will hear thunder crash. If you are caught, keep moving. My friends, remain here, and at this time, NPCs, take your place in the nightmare. Good luck, travelers. Batman. Oh, I need luck. Oh, fuck. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Remember, friends, don't get caught. Three, two, one. Friends, make sure I have two positive Your quest begins now. Oh, look through rooms. Oh, arrows above us, Nico. There's arrows above us. Nico, look. Oh. I accidentally <laughs> won. <laughs> that was recently like, told. Uh, there we go. Why are you constantly moving? Start back here. Can we get this in the campfire song? The Tartalia. Alright. No. Bro, no, not again. Why do you turn it on? What do I do without getting caught? Sing the campfire song. Sing the campfire song. I'll go throw myself in the pond. I've never heard it. What? Why is no one getting caught yet? Yeah. 
Like, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, who's going to do the game? Okay, alright, bye. Okay, he's in the pond now. That means it's time. Is that the Geiger counter sound I heard from you, Pwn? Did you say it's No. Yes, it was. I heard that. That's what it was. Yeah. I do one wrong thing and it's. Yes! Tempire I didn't manage to shoot any of the monsters. Oh, I'm <laughs> 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 Oh yeah! <laughs> oh yeah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love that. There we go. Is that all? He always got to do the campfire. I think we might have succeeded. Right. Glorious. I heard one crash. There, there were two. Of course, and why are you cooking your entire bag? You might have succeeded in invading them this time. Hi, Luna. I'm Luna's mom. Is that fixed? Right, so yeah, I like her. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, there you go. See, I think that's one more thing. It's a wicked uh, uh, welcome song. Oh, She's like, come on, think come on. I'm having a pretty good time. She called you too. Why is it so optimized? Aw, I'm blushing. You're sweet. I'm a nightmarish camera creature. Yo, we make part of a regularly balanced diet. That was kind of weird. I'm trying to talk with voice because, aw. Oh, oh, my friend. Because you're a reaction. Travelers. Your attention, please. Dearest travelers, lend me your ears, your robotic sensors, and whatever else you use to perceive sound waves. I, per I perceive sound waves via oh, audio receptors. I eat sound. Oh my goodness, I say something else. Is that normal? No. My friends, yeah. the story continues. Congratulations, you have passed the quest of Nightmare One. If my memory serves me correct, this is only the second time this has happened. Wow. Well, that's impressive. Yeah. Yeah. The NPCs and other people and how we're supposed to count the girl. The girl wakes herself up, screaming in the dark of night, her eyes filled with tears as she frantically calls for her mother. Quickly, she's comforted. The daughter begins describing a dark place with monsters, but she struggles to speak through her trembling. The mother rocks her in her arms, telling her it was just a nightmare, not to worry. The daughter tries to go on about how the person in her dream was searching for something, but her voice is shaking too much. The mother interrupts, telling her it was not real. She's safe now. Together they sit, rocking for a while as the rain dies down. And soon the morning sun is revealed, shining like a golden orb between parting storm clouds. The mother thinks to herself that the town of Shade has always been a place rebel supplies move through. Surely clues to the Ethos Coalition are there. The mother checks the sky. Clear for now. My friends, this way. Walk sideways. I'm going to take that, 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 and I'm good. All right, camp has been packed up. Let's go.
<laughs> you having fun? No, I am. <laughs> yeah, we'll see you come in here and grab him. Grab him. Damn, I did get a question. I mean, they miscolored them. I just miscolored them. I thought they were green. I hear the two of guys. Hmm. Geo, don't be alarmed, it's me, it's not you. I know. I don't know how I fucking got here, but why are you just... Travelers, gather around. The story continues. Got it. The town of Shade is a small, busy, unfriendly place. The people here don't smile or greet each other as they pass. The mother and daughter feel unwelcome. The mother doesn't know who to trust or who is loyal to the Grey. First, she needs to find a safe place for them to get some proper rest. The mother books a room, which the innkeeper says will be ready a little later. She checks the sky, then tells the daughter that they should gather supplies while they wait as they likely have a long way to go tomorrow. My friends, this is your next quest. Listen carefully. You have five minutes to complete this quest. You must return here in front of the inn before five minutes is up. All of you can explore the town of Shade. Scattered around are various supplies and clues the mother and daughter need. If you find an interesting looking item, please click it. You have five minutes to search and you will hear a bell. Okay, now onward. Please do not worry. The sky is clear for now, and so your quest begins. Let's go. You shall know the good word of Sigma. And. <laughs> the mermaid tears up here. Why is it here? <laughs> That's I don't know why. I wonder if the right half is here. That'd Hello. Son. Sigma ball. I made it, and no broken bones. So. I'm looking for my copy of Woo Baby. Oh, where am I? Or just one. What? There's some. For instance, your Amazon. Take my balls! Oh my god, advance my combat. I got an Amen! You jinx from Arcane! Can I get an Amen? Amen! <laughs> and, like, hold up. And these are from. There's something green for Emma. I'm laggy here lately. Mini, I can't. Dreamer song. Sweet, can I have it back? I don't want it. Sure, I mean. Mm. So, ah. the, uh, this is all the other She missed Totem.
books, books. Oof, first aid. Oh, that's how they did it. They just shoved the item down on the ground. Dagger. What happened? Oh, I'm actually taking a moment to like appreciate how this world was made, and like looking at how the vertexes are welded together, how items float off the ground. It's a lot different than they oh, designed for Dragon Quest Nine. Oh, the sword. I see. Yeah, over here. I'm awesome. Hey, don't start showing me up. I called Ebbs on the bathtub. My bad. Let's even let's start. Yo, when things are slightly spookier and you're like, I'm being haunted. Right now, that's us. You're the ones haunting them. That's fun. That's actually. Okay. I'm witnessing. If anyone's wondering why the lighting is on this part, right? Would you like some geo water? Geo selling his bath. Water by the rocks. Ew. Geo for the god. I'm just standing here because this is the water. God damn, that sounds embarrassing. But almost as good as sign you bath water. Gene, do you support that? Gene, do you want to have a little bit of fun with one of these? Do the two. The two make their way up to the prepared bedroom and begin settling in. It's quiet inside the inn. Clouds have gathered outside once again, casting the small space in a dull gray light. Finally, they can rest. The daughter is helping her mother sort the items they gathered today. She wants to help by carrying a few of them in her own little bag. But she isn't sure which items to choose. My friends, listen carefully. Press the tab key to view your inventory. If you're in VR, hold your right hand above eye level and press the menu or jump button. Shit, I can't raise my hand. I can't see them. Oh, what the fuck? Review the items that you have gathered in the town of Shade. 
<laughs> and now I will call people okay. out. Please pick on me. Please pick on me. Please pick on me. To choose one item each. Please. I would like to pick an item. Okay. I'd I like to pick an item. I choose my legendary Don't item. Please That's stop. Man. Call. I finally my got the friends. item that I wanted to get. Oh I beg of your silence. I choose you, Pikachu. I will leave my wife. A hey, weirdo. Hello there. May I call on you? Charmander, I use you. Yes. <laughs> hey, weirdo. Tell me, what is one item the daughter will carry for her mother? Hmm. You can also I think the infused you. dagger. Ooh, spicy choice. The infused dagger. <laughs> An excellent choice. Where its is blade is decorated, with? and the ether is the ether it is infused with has a long story. This dagger oh. has traveled far across mountains, uh -huh. held by those in a beautiful city, surrounded by waterfalls. Oh my God! Uh, can I go next? Oh, is it the engraving dagger? Yeah, from the appraiser. What? It's infused with woo, baby. Oh, look, I might be for the second <laughs> item. Me, 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 please, please. Oh, listen, no cool. <laughs> please. please stop. Oh, no, I actually have something I want to order. Dino bun, may I call uh, on you? Yes. Dino bun, what is one item the daughter will carry for her mother? I, I kind of want to pick the move baby volume one. There we go. My friends. Oh. Dino Bun, an excellent oh, choice. The Woo Baby is an adventure <laughs> tale. A good read. I highly recommend. And that after the tour, you go to Trey Jim's library in the rendezvous and ask to check this book out. Did you just say library? He fucking yes. 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 Oh my god. It's more like an archive. And are we gonna jump to that? Oh now? dear. Approved. I thought it was library. the correct pronunciation is the library. Oh god, not you truth. too. Library. You don't library. Up, a -A library. Library. Meme complex only capable of repeating what I've heard. It is the mortal's fault for my mistakes. Now for yeah, the third yeah, item. <laughs> Me, can I can I pick one, please? I finally have a good no. one that I want to pick. <laughs> I want to pick one. <laughs> Kirby, you have suffered much with your internet connection. Yes, Kirby. What is the third item the daughter will carry? <laughs> Okay, so last time I picked the TIA director's coat, but this time I want to do something more fitted for me. So how about we go with the mermaid ring? Hmm. Hmm. I think that was mm. used before. Okay. But whatever. All right. The mermaid ring. Try to hold your excitement, dear. Oh wait. <laughs> A hidden item given only to those that are careful to find certain items through a story a tricky item to obtain for sure well done kirby the story continues The mother sits on the bed, leaning against the window frame. She's tired of running, tired of hiding, but she cannot stop. Not yet. She looks through the window at the town as the evening sun sinks behind gray clouds. The town is painted with a soft pink light. The daughter jumps up on the bed, cuddles up to her mother, and holds tightly onto her bunny doll. Are we going to stay here? She asks. I want to go home. The mother brushes her daughter's hair to the side. Not for long. We're going somewhere else tomorrow, somewhere safe. Is that where Daddy went? 
The daughter looks up at her mother, hopeful. I think so. You need to sleep, so you can walk with me tomorrow. You need to sleep too. The little girl nudges her and places a hand over her mother's heart. She can feel it beating steadily. The feeling comforts her. Daddy said, I need to protect Mama. The mother breaks into a heartwarming smile. You already are, my angel. Daddy says you're a good luck charm, as though you have friends watching over you. Friends watching over me and Bunny? She looks at the ceiling all around the room, but there's nobody there. The mother laughs. <laughs> mm-hmm. The daughter squeezes her bunny doll and goes silent. She thinks deeply for a six-year-old. Mama, will my friends watch over your heart too? She puts an arm around her daughter and pulls her in. Her answer comes only as a whisper between them, a fragile breath. I hope so. I hope so. The daughter nods, snuggles up close, and falls asleep within minutes. The mother wipes tears from her own eyes and looks back out the window. Night has come. My friends, mother will keep watch while we all sleep, for what is good never lasts. Please, use the nightmare save point and follow the daughter into her dreams once more. We're supposed to be sleeping. I want to have another nightmare. Guys, there's another nightmare. Oh my god. Every time. Yeah, people that fall off. Hey guys, Fire. have any of you heard the tragedy of Darden oh, playing as the wise? Oh, 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 you were oh, 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 no, oh, man. No, I was, I was acting out the daughter when the yeah. dude was speaking. I was like, wait a second, oh. what were you doing? I was like, what the f- I was like, what? You were, I, was like, I was like, that's what you were doing, this was like, are you holding up? Oh, uh, like frame wise. Well, I'm okay. I thought you just looked like a hug. No, I guess you were acting. I, like, I kind of. Well, I guess it was a hug wanted by the daughter in the scene. If you pay attention to it, it was a cuddle, yeah. So it seemed to be a hug either way. Like, so. What? Attention. Tonight's NPCs. Please change into your dream Ezer avatars and stand next to me. <laughs> is it this time? Who do we get? And the L man. As they yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 to be honest, I don't see any nightmares. Only with dreams. You really are, Theo. I'm gonna get a screenshot of this and just title the screenshot of PC Nightmare. Oh my god! Game level 1000. That time VR Travelers got sued by Nintendo. Pretty much. Watch easy, best to move! Waluigi, please don't bust a move. Once you are satisfied with the amount of screenshots that you have taken, <laughs> please continue remaining there. And at this time, NPCs, at this time, please take your place in the nightmare. Listen carefully. Once more, the unknown figure becomes aware. The air is colder, but their vision feels somehow sharper. Perhaps this place is a little brighter than the last. The last place. Yes, they are here for a reason. The figure thinks in silence. What am I searching for? Why can't I remember who I am? Glancing back over their shoulder, they see only swirling shadow, and it evokes a sense of unholy dread. 
something is following. My friends, this is your next quest. This time, there are no monsters to avoid, but instead, a pair of dream eaters block the exit. Find the path that gives you hope. Gather around the dream eaters at the end and give them your attention and your silence and answer their spoken trial. Your quest begins now. Make haste. I must find them. I must dream of you. Everybody loses. Get this Why in front of us. Off of it, off of it. Hey, 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 Oh, oh, no. 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 Maybe in the second time. <laughs> <turn to me. laughs> Can yeah, I don't know if you remember this dream either. I don't know if you remember this dream either. I don't know if you remember this dream either. I don't know if you remember this dream either. I don't know if you remember this dream either. Travelers, I beg of your silence. Please give your attention to the NPCs of tonight. One's AFK. It's delayed again. Wait, am I just remembering this? <laughs> Travelers, we are finally meet. Now you must answer a riddle or a pay us all your coins. <laughs> Excuse me while I remember the riddle. Alright, I think it's I remember. So ready for the pit, and not that this is cool. your uh, I believe it. <laughs> I can tell. Alright, I think I got this. Great explorer of starry skies. <laughs> Are you? Sojourner of a blue horizon. On <laughs> heavy wings at. Hold on, hold on, we have an error. I realize I messed up the script. I am so sorry, Wario. Great explorer of the sea's reflection. <laughs> Sojourner of a blue horizon. On heavy wings, I venture the starry skies. Who am I? Now I answer carefully. <laughs> or you will be poor! <laughs> I already am poor. I'm a cat. Oh, yeah. Fool, I'm already poor. Travelers chat in Discord if you missed it. I repeat, the riddle will be written in the Travelers chat in the Discord. Oh. <laughs> I gave a joke answer. Let me take time with these bone heads. I, I really, I had, I had such an urge to say Sephiroth for some reason. <laughs> What is I will Jesus? beat you in tennis if you dare say that. I'm not going to contribute to this riddle because I'm. Someone I'm says the moon? Solving riddles. Yeah, I think that's, 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 that's the excuse. Uh, he was uh, just in a cat. Someone else's spaceship. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, and now I think oh, explore the sea's reflection. I think it's simple. I think it's a sea's reflection. I think it's a star. 
I mean, heavy wings. I, I could just be the pilot. <laughs> it's a two hour order. Oh, yeah, We're is. getting the riddle yeah, from. Wait. A visitor. Oh, okay. A so plane. Would be visitor. I'm not yeah, good with like, riddles. It worked out so well. Like, yeah, so visitors of the blue horizon. Spaceship sounds yeah. I'm more than a little scared. I'm just like, Why are you here? It could just be. Give us your money. Like a regular. I don't have any money. That's the problem. Like I was not prepared for this. I didn't think I'd have to use my brain on this. Hey, that's a mine. All right. I got monopoly money. Take my monopoly money. Yeah, yeah. Hey, sorry, sorry, why are we doing this? Always take the money when you have Nintendo. Take all my money. Take it. Take it all. Take it. Take all my money. Take all my money. And now I have to wait until that uh, portal appears. Oh, I think somebody got it right. Because we don't know how to act. Oh, wait. Someone went to answer the riddle? Yeah. Yeah. Amber, I think we got it. The sea's reflection is the sky. We got it. No way, I think it's a shell answer. Everyone's shouting. I'd say astronaut. I counted the three. If we're applying it to the moon. Who's our spokesperson? I'll agree on the answer. Who's the spokesperson? I will choose for you if you don't. I'll speak it out if I have to. The answer is Luna's mom. I do know that. It doesn't sound like everyone is in agreement on what the uh, answer is. So we'll give you a few more seconds. Phil King, I do not desire to be held. I like the idea of Dream Jesus your Christ. time has expired. Demand an answer. All right. Someone will come forward. Who has it? Who has it? I, it? I, say I will astronaut. come forward. Can Should I go up and say what is our answer? I see. It. Uh, I see. It. Oh, I see. It. I see it. This person volunteers himself. The pilot. I'll do it later. Ether. Then you are the one Wait, giving me the answer. Wait. Who said what? The pilot. Is it just the pilot? Hold on. Who is an answer? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Here. It's what? Ether. What? Yeah. What did uh, we agree on? Very shocking. Oh yeah. What was your answer? The, the pilot. I guess yeah. spaceship seems to be the most unanimous. The answer was the pilot. I heard the pilot. Yes. The group is. The group seems to say. So, too many people are. Let the weirdo speak up. Okay. Everyone shush. Let the weirdo speak up. He's in number one right now. You, Ether, you will. Keep your spaceship. I will depart then. All right. Pilot. Tell me when. I, tell me when I'm good. I want to make sure it's fucking out. Oh, game okay. The, the answer was the pilot. The answer is the pilot. You are correct, travelers! Oh, shit. <laughs> 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 I'm still here. Yeah. No, you're the one who did it. Thank you. Without Stop me, did it. Me for your screw ups, water. Yeah. Take my money. Yeah, Even though we still got to take our money. money. Sexy, he's a traveler. My first answer is Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Take our money. With riddles, Take my money. So, you we don't have any more similarities on that aspect. Number one. I have a rotten day. Why, why am I throwing money at you when I won? Why am I throwing money at you when I won? You're being nice. You're being nice. Yeah. I'm trying to grab the money, but I keep getting hit by the What a clusterfuck. This was so chaotic. Everyone, throw money. Me neither. Why? I'm not I want the money. That's what they want. This is the Who threw a vault? Beach ball. Dearest travelers. It's appearing act. Congratulations. You have passed the quest. For Nightmare 2. Cool. This performance was beautifully chaotic. I <laughs> cannot tell if it was so bad it was good or so good because it was bad. Either way, I know that I loved it. Those, those are, a little bit of column, a little those are the same yeah. thing. That was amazing. No. <laughs> My friends. Oh, 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 oh,
A jewel shines on the ocean floor. It waits under immense pressure. A soul holding it cries. But no one would ever tell. No one would ever know. Because the tear that is shed is just a small drop of the surrounding distorted oh. A mermaid tear is granted to the travelers. Thank you. Thank you for your donation, Kirby. Thanks. You're welcome. Is this like a gas, is this like a gas tear? My friends. We now cry the more. figure passes between the strange nightmare manifestations <laughs> so happy. and enters a new space. Oh, we have there the left comes the scent of Not dust and there. rust. They look ahead, peering into shadows that feel distant, and the shape begins to take form. It is colossal. It hangs in an abyss, majestic and imposing. Its wings cut through the darkness like great blades of night. And there it waits, motionless, expectant. My friends, it is time to wake up from this nightmare. Please, use the wake save point. Five more minutes. Five more minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to get up. Wake up. Minutes. He's in the Number one. Wake up, Lieutenant. <laughs> wake up. Oh, <laughs> wake up, wake up, wake up Santamai. Wake up, Lieutenant. I had I have to teleport just to even I'm like getting here. Alright. Because my VR is working I I couldn't get into the nightmare thing, so I had to teleport to you guys. Yeah, I'm right. Oh. Wanna make a 29? Yeah, hey, Metal Doom, wanna make a 29? Yeah. Possibly back to normal. Well done on the Probably haven't actually made That's many multiverses. Why well, stop at 29? Go for 100. Excuse me. Damn, that was quite Travelers. Travelers. The girl is jolted awake by a loud bang that shakes the room. A vase topples from the table and smashes on the floor. We have to go. Get dressed. We have to go now. The girl tries to explain to her mother about the nightmare, about how she knows what the person is searching for. The room shakes again, cracking the window this time. She stops mid-sentence when she looks through the broken when she looks through the broken glass. Its image distorted, fragmented. It hangs in the night sky. It is here. The monster is here. It's following us. The little girl shrieks before tumbling from the bed. There are sounds of a firefight outside the town. Don't look at it. The mother comes to grab her. It's going to be okay. Mama will protect you. We have to leave. Now. The world comes down around them. Everyone, this way. Have camouflage. Oh, yes, fire. Fire! Yes, fire! I wonder if this was caused by the Mario Brothers. Not this way. Okay, I've got the great idea to make money, Waluigi. We'll set the tower on fire for insurance fraud. It's different. This is my pyramid scheme. <laughs> I set the tower on fire and everyone has to pay. Wait, just claims to me. Pyramid scheme. Oh, how oh, oh Jesus. Every time, you never know when you're going to be unexpected and unheard of anyway. occurring in the world. And every time I have to do this. You face Waluigi! Oh, not that he has none of that. We're fine, we're fine, we're actually. Oh, fuck, yeah. Mario, are fine. Every time we go through this. You're going to miss the best part. I assure you the ending is worth it. 
unfortunate. I, <laughs> one of you is greatly regretting his decision. Tired. Yeah. Oh, outnumbered. We've been trying to fix this avatar oh, for however long. It doesn't work. Wake up, man. The accident wasn't Look. your fault. Travelers, <laughs> the story <laughs> continues. Thanks. This With is daughter in tow, the mother makes her way to the town oh, exit oh, opposite the firefight. In the streets, the mother spots a motorcycle lying on its side, still running. She goes to lift it. Halt! A large soldier oh, appears, armed with a gun blade. The town of Shade is now under martial law by order of the Grey. All civilians are to report for ether scanning. Come with me. The daughter holds her mother's hand tight. She states they were already scanned and have no potential. She slowly backs away. No. I said halt! The soldier orders. He then presses a button on his visor. The mother sees this and pushes her daughter to run and hide behind a wooden crate. With a racing heart, the mother now stands defiantly between her daughter and the towering soldier. His eyes go wide as he reads his visor display. What's this? You haven't been scanned. You both are coming with me. With his eyes on the sky, the soldier reaches for his comms, preparing to notify command of his discovery. The mother must think fast. And so begins your next quest. You have 30 seconds to decide as a group which of the three options to choose from. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. Time begins now. Um, this is the eyes on the sky. Uh, and the sky uh, is the map. Uh, uh, it's a tank. The answer is a tank. The answer is a The answer to this is a tank. 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 Watch out, watch out, I got it. No, it's okay, I'll get it. No, wait! We'll use the power of friendship. <laughs> Time has expired. Not one of the options, unfortunately. Nico. Nico Wafer 1. Tell me, what will the mother do? I think we uh, all set attack. With the soldier distracted and one arm occupied, she rushes him from the side. Cut off guard, the soldier raises his arms, allowing her, to, allowing her heel to strike his unguarded torso and knock the wind out of him. He drops the comm device, but catches her by the wrist. With his other arm, he makes a tight fist and hooks her hard in the face, fracturing her jaw. The soldier has taken significant damage this round. No broken bones this time. Uh, the mother yeah. was knocked to the ground, but quickly stands up. The soldier shoulders his gun blade, aiming at her heart. Attack, defend, or mother's instinct. Mother's instinct. <laughs> Tell me, what will the mother do? Defend. 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 Like, it de like what are we talking about? Defend. Yeah, you yeah, defend. I don't know. Consult the like, spreadsheet as one yeah. does in such that's, a situation. I think that's meant to be a thing. Is I think I don't think we're meant to. Do. Funky chaos. I think we're meant to use that. I call on you. Right. Yeah, you. You. Soldier boy. Apologies, I cannot hear. I will relay your message. You call. Where you go? That works. Mother's instinct. That's mother's instinct. Oh, funky chaos. What? Oh my god. He said mother's instinct. Yeah. He said mother's instinct. She thinks to herself she can't die here and dives to dodge the shot. It misses. She's fast, but not fast enough to get close for a strike. He takes another shot, hitting her deep in the upper leg. Seeing her slowed now, he moves in close. The soldier has taken no significant damage this round. At some point, if you and I ever become uh, NPCs for another tour and, and it works right enough, I can barely hear anything. <laughs> Don't the post those up there. I think we would defend next. That's not important. To defend, we'll defend, defend, but. We're just kind of stuck. We're kind of stuck, so we gotta play yeah, it we're very wisely. Now, we're, yeah, we're kind of in a corner. We're kind of back in the corner. The soldier raises the gun blade high, preparing for a downward strike. Attack, defend, 
or mother's instinct? Defend. If it's raising, we can raise it. Mother's instinct. Oh, it is. All right. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Now that I think about it, yeah. Instinct. Instinct. Yeah. That's right. on you. My brain's running. You may. Tell me. Attack. Defend or mother's instinct. What will she do? We defend. Okay. She moves quick to his side, dodging the strike. She then grapples the gunblade handle, wrestling it free from the soldier. Before she can position herself to swing it, he hooks her hard in the stomach, and she drops the weapon. The angry soldier grabs her left arm and twists it into a lock. She manages to unclip an incendiary grenade from his belt. But he then brings his elbow down hard, breaking her left arm at the wrist. The soldier has taken no damage this round. Mom's gonna die at this rate. We Seven have one right. arm, one good. We have oh, one we good arm, one good we leg. We should be neutral, Andy boys. <laughs> we have one good arm, yeah. one good Final leg, and already. a broken and a fractured jaw. Yeah. <laughs> it's time. Witnessing all of this, the daughter screams right. for her mother. Now positioned between them, the soldier grabs the little girl and growls for the mother to drop the grenade or she dies. The daughter shouts. Leave us alone! Just as a blue aura erupts around her. Attack. Defend. Or mother's instinct. Defend. 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 G. I believe you are AFK. Delirious. Delirious. May I call on you? Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna Delirious, go what will the mother do? Defends. Not the parents. Mm -hmm. well. She said defend. Defend? Ah, uh, yes. She the meets her daughter's eyes and shouts, yeah, Protect us! <laughs> the girl drops her bunny doll and closes her eyes. The aura explodes into a torrent of blue flames. The soldier tries to block. But the pure ether rips into him, sending him flying through a wall. <laughs> Severely injured, but still alive, the soldier gets up. Immediately, he runs to his mech, climbing up into the open cockpit. Just before the door closes, the mother throws the incendiary grenade inside. Oh. Yes. Uh-oh. The ground shakes. Oh, but not because of the grenade. A shadow sweeps across everything. The dark monument oh now God. hovers over the town <laughs> gates, dropping bolts of blazing fire in every direction. I think it shows up in the, the mother grunts in pain as she lifts the bullet riddled motorcycle. She calls for her daughter to get on, but the girl stands unmoving, staring at the monster in the sky. Quickly, she pulls her up on with her. She still has one strong leg and arm, and the adrenaline is masking the pain. For now. We're going to be okay, she tells her daughter. I promise. We have to, she thinks to herself. Together, they speed away from the inferno that was the town of Shade. Hi. Travelers, this way. At least we made it out of the life. I had to put down the weapon. I wait. Mom looks like she's gonna live. At the very least, Mom looks like she's gonna live. They are they are magic. I'm bullet wounds, so it looks like she may live unless there's like internal bleeding. Very nice. Uh, she'll be fine, don't worry. Yeah, she'll be fine, but yeah, no, she'll probably be fine. It's just a bullet wound. So, uh, was AFK for a little bit? It's one bullet wound. It's okay. Uh, uh, the people texting me at the same continues. time. That's not actually Ooh. the bike. They ride bad. for hours. You're Mr. Popular. The trail is empty. <laughs> the sound of the wind and the rumble of the engine slowly fade out in the mother's mind. 
It's like watching things burn. All she can hear are her own thoughts alongside the painful thumps in her chest. The daughter holds on silently, eyes staring vacantly into the darkening sky. Angel, I'm so sorry. We are almost there. We will be at a safe place soon, the mother says. The daughter does not respond. This way. Yo, Laifu? Is this the Laifu cameo we've been looking for? Oh, that was bad. I got a bad shiver. My mom walked in, and, and I told her what just happened, because she was, like, so confused why I'm going to And I told her what happened. She goes, that's one badass bitch. Hey, hey, Jim. Oh, for sure, for sure. Yeah. Further on during the story, when the ship goes under Travelers. underneath, I want to be the one to get the answer, please. The story continues. <laughs> Hold on to your hearts. Things are about to get dark. Oh no! You're in my heart. The sky oh. is dark. The outpost looms ahead, various points of light moving about. The mother left the motorcycle on the road. It ran out of fuel a while ago. She leads her daughter by the hand, struggling to breathe as they walk. Finally, they're somewhere safe. She grips her chest tight. Wait. Something isn't right. This is meant to be a waypoint for smugglers. Why are there soldiers everywhere? Gray soldiers. The mother breaks down. She lets go of her daughter's hand and drops to her knees. This is hopeless. They can't escape. What is she even doing? The information from Shade. Why? It hurts. Everything hurts. And it's getting worse by the minute. Mama? The daughter's voice is tiny and feeble. Mama, are you okay? The mother looks at her daughter. You should sleep, Mama. I'll sleep too. And we can go to the dream world together. The mother looks up at her. I thought there were monsters there, but I know who it actually is. It's safe there, Mama. Let's go to sleep and forget this place. The mother listens to her daughter's words and begins to cry. She can't die here, and this poor child, her angel is succumbing to the drama. She looks at the dirt that her hands are gripping. No. She has to be stronger. She has to make her own hope. The mother stands back up. She takes back her daughter's hand. There has to be a way through here. My friends, let's follow the mother this way. Whoa! That's not foreboding. Everything is foreboding. This is this is this is getting sucky now that I see. Quite a lot of robots. Feeling. Oh god! There are a lot of robots in our group. Oh, it's the Liberty Prime. Oh, Never tell me the odds. Oh, one, I guess. Excellent observation. Wow. Well, they they snake through the building carefully, avoiding the patrols. They stop and remain silent as two soldiers approach one another. The soldiers stop to talk, and the mother listens carefully. Yeah, 
I... I'm sure you've heard, but Shade's been wiped from the map. Nothing left but ashes. It doesn't feel real. One soldier says with a worried tone. I'm not surprised. The Dark Monument is in the region, and Shade was a known supply point for the Ethos. But what if it comes here? They say it just destroys everything that's not a part of its unit. Unlikely. That machine they excavated is here. It's scheduled for transport to District Zero. They would not destroy something this important. You mean, that creepy mech nobody is allowed to go near? Yeah. Rumor has it, there is an ether amplifier on board. The scanners can't make sense of it. That's impossible. I thought you can only fit those on big warships. Don't you need to grow them or something crazy like that? Well, whatever it is, I heard they can't get the mech to work. It fries any equipment we attach to it. Hey, do you want to see it before it ships out? Nobody is watching it now. No way, that thing gives me the creeps. The soldiers part ways to continue their patrols. Before leaving the area, one of the soldiers notices a small blue orb on the ground. The mother realizes it must have fallen from her pocket. Examining it up close, he says, Oi, what luck! A mermaid tear, the key ingredient to making a June the mermaid drink. These mixed ether crystals are fantastically rare. I'll be swimming in my dreams tonight. The soldier hurries off. The mother concludes that the mech they spoke of is their only chance to leave this region. She looks at her daughter. The girl has been silent, staring vacantly at the wall since they have arrived. She wants to check if she's all right, but they need to move. This way. Beep, 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 beep. Thank you. Beep, beep. <laughs> Here we are. Whoa. Here we go again. This is it. It's I think now we got or never. Oh. You oh, just have to listen. It's like a pro tag oh, right there. Oh. The missing yeah, I've just piece. been chilling until about now. Spoiler alert. The mermaid freaking yeah, That's fine. No, pro tag is This is going to be the best, the best part to see. Look at that. Pro tag is nice. The moment we've been yeah, waiting for. <laughs> the music box. Yep. I know okay. it's gonna be we have to get these answers right. Pull up my thing. Just know it. I know. There it stands. I mean, alone. we can do this. I'm pretty sure we got it. To Mac. He's talking. The air is thick around it, drowning out sound and somehow the glare of the night lights. This is our own. This is our only chance. If there's anyone up there, please help me. No, I can do this. The mother thinks to herself. It's warm to the touch. The cockpit eerily and silently opens. Not wasting time, the mother motions for her daughter to climb inside with her, but the girl refuses. The mother looks up and sees a guard in the distance slowly patrolling closer. She kneels down to her eye level and whispers in frustration that they need to fly this to where Daddy is. The daughter backs away from her and the mech. She speaks with a quivering voice. No, that's not the right way. We need to wait here. What? The mother is confused and tries to reach for her daughter. We have to go now. No! It's the pilot in the dream, Mama. We need to wait for the pilot. The daughter says louder as she backs away again. Angel, please. They are going to see us. I am the pilot, and we are going to fly this away from here. Get in now, please. I don't want to. We'll be safe if we go to sleep. The daughter says louder, starting to cry. Stop, please, Angel, calm down. Please. She pleads with her right arm outstretched. I don't want to go in there again, Mama! The child shrieks. 
It's too late. A soldier on the wall shouts and triggers the intruder alarms. Sirens blare, and the daughter panics. She runs into her mother's arms. Blinding spotlights quickly discover their whereabouts, illuminating the mother and daughter, holding one another under ghostly white light. The pilot will save us, the pilot will save us, the pilot will save us, she says, <laughs> over and over, before fainting. The mother holds her daughter, and the sirens continue to blare. Soldiers are making their way down the walls. She looks over at the magenta mech's open cockpit. It's a pitch black void within. My friends, please use the still save point. This is it. The moment of truth. Another another time. No more choices. Yes, right time for epic page. battle music. Okay, go, okay. Is G all right, here it is. Oh, all the last time I was here, I love no this one. Yes. All right, Jay Monkey, you have the password. Oh, okay, hey, you're here. Just keep talking about this. I yeah. It's like you're always you just right here when we need you. I have well, here's the power of friendship. Yeah. Shut up. up. Right, anyway, so. Also, if you said the word, I would have summoned you. You know. Jay has the password. It's everyone to kiss him. Everyone yeah. knows to. Yeah. But like, as Morelda. I could no know it. <laughs> that would require me to have Emerald. a piece of memory. Emerald. That's him. For some reason. Emerald. It's easy to mix it up because you think Esmeralda, but no, it's Emerald. So, it's uh, Emerald what? It's pretty it's, 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 it's May I make a comment? No. Okay, Emerilda We've been working on this upcoming don't encounter don't for some know. time. Yep. We have an idea of what the answers are, and if yep. you would and be I, so I, kind I, to cooperate with us uh, in doing what we think is right. We want to get the good end. Yes. Alright. Uh, the correct My friends, your attention please. The story will now continue. Please keep your hands and feet inside the tour vehicle at all times. What about our tails? And hold on to your hearts. <laughs> I want to feel the wind. The mother secures um, the passenger seat belt around her daughter. She readies herself in the pilot seat and notices there are no movement controls. She places her right hand over her pounding, aching chest while frantically searching for a way to start the machine. Come on, please turn on. It can't end like this, she thinks. Suddenly, the dashboard lights up. An automated voice speaks. Initiating startup sequence. Memetic drive connected. Scanning for contact identity markers. Negative. Unregistered pilot detected. Please input ether engine access code. My friends, you have 15 seconds to give the ether engine access code. Emerald 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 we would like to let Jay Monkey speak the code. Emerald Casu. Amarilda Cassin. Amarilda Cassin. That, whatever they say. Yeah. Amarilda Cassin. Alright, Amarilda Cassin. Oh no. I know that, I know that, but who is this? Okay, uh, the are about to eat the original Kim, pilot of the ship. Kassin, <laughs> one of the reincarnations. Uh, <laughs> nanobot Nanny soldier. Daughter. Okay, so it's a re so, so basically it's a. Uh, <laughs> okay, it's thank you. Robo That's kid. the answer I was looking for. Okay, that, 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 that's Robo the answer. Okay. Wait, I had a kid. I was technically still their kid. Uh, what? Still their kid. Let's, let's move. Oh, oh, time time has expired. Patience. His friends. <laughs> I have heard your answer, and it will be transcribed through the narrative. The daughter suddenly shouts in her sleep, speaking a name the mother does not recognize. The computer responds.
Access granted. Igniting ether engine. Welcome back, Holy Mother. Here we go. The magenta mag begins to levitate. Initiating healing drive. The mother's heart is stabilized. Warning. Hostile lock-ons detected. Four enemy go. units. Four. Okay. The mother's four. mind is shown four, four combat four. techniques. Oh, there you are. My friends, All right, what do you, guys you have? must choose from Heaven's Fist, no. Divine Impact, no. Holy Choir Storm, yes, Holy and Choir Grand Storm. Cathedral Ray. The third one? Holy Choir Storm. Holy Choir Storm. It's what Holy we Choir Storm. Storm. Holy Choir Storm. Yeah, say Fire Storm. Holy Choir Storm. Holy Choir Storm. Holy Choir Storm. Holy Choir Storm. Is it? I can't see it. I can't see it. Where is it? Yes. Holy Choir Storm. God damn it. Holy Choir Storm. Holy Choir Storm. Okay. Kerp. Holy Choir Storm. The Traveler sounds confident. Holy Killed Tails. We are Geo Nexus. Time has yes. expired. Travelers, oh, listen four. carefully. Geo Nexus, the Grey Army attacks. What will the mother do? Holy Choir Storm, right? Yes, Holy Choir Storm. Yes, Holy, Choir. Right. Holy Choir Storm. The Magenta Mech. The Magenta Mech ascends high, disappearing into the storm above. Bright yellow light begins flashing rapidly from within the clouds. With a loud crash of thunder, the mother rockets down from the sky, covered in golden ether bolts. Her wings mimic a chorus crescendo through the wind as she rams headfirst into the group, decimating the enemy. All enemies destroyed. Ether amplifier yes. charge increased yes. by 25%. Yes! yes. Good start. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's do this. Yes. Let us alert goes off in the finish this fight. Eight. Hostile lock ons detected. Uh oh. The Grey Army attacks. What will the mother do? Divine impact! Divine impact! Divine impact! Divine impact! Divine impact! Kirby, have you ever considered the possibility that you killed Tails? I haven't seen that video, I'm sorry, I don't get that reference. Don't you dare! You murdered Tails in cold blood and repressed the memories! I'll have to watch that video when, <laughs> when this is over. <laughs> Go what, watch it. What the oh, fuck are you next. doing? Uh, Tails is late, I think. What, what does this mean? Travelers, time has expired. Your attention, please. That's the funny part. Misfit, I, I call on you. Divine Invict, Divine Invict, Divine Invict. Misfit, are you there? I don't think he is. Misfit, tell me, what does the group say? What will the mother do? Divine Impact! Divine Impact! The Magenta Mech's wings extend as it begins charging up with ether. She swings a leg high, then brings it down hard, striking the earth. The shockwave travels underground, then explodes upward under the enemy group in a burst of molten rock and ether. All enemies destroyed. Ether amplifier charged by 25%. <laughs> yes! Team. Let's go. Nico, I want you to know I didn't forget the name because of you saying Genshin Impact. <laughs> I almost I fucked up saying it like 50 times because of that one two, two words. <laughs> An alert goes off in the cockpit. Warning: 12 hostile lock-ons detected. The gray army attacks. What will the mother do? Or in this case, where it does shit. It's all cool. We're doing this. Heaven's Feast! Get out of me. Time has expired. Travelers, your attention, please. Metalin. Metalin, do you speak? Uh, yeah, yes. 
Madeline. Heaven's fist. Tell me, what will the mother do? Heaven's fist. Heaven's fist. Please. Heaven's fist. Heaven's fist. Heaven's fist. Heaven's fist. Heaven's fist. Don't put the iron. Heaven's fist thing. That's totally wrong when you put the Heaven's fist. The magenta mech raises its arms skyward, and a golden lightning bolt strikes the fist. The mother moves into a warrior's stance as golden arcs crackle down the body. On the offensive, she tears into the center of their formation with a flurry of brutal combos, and ending with a thunderous uppercut which sends the whole group flying. All enemies destroyed. Ether amplifier charged by 25%. I love you, Keith. 75% now? I missed the bad one. Yes. 100%! Next will be Grand Cathedral. You sound like you're about to cry. This feels... Yeah, one more. We've been doing this for a while. I turn off the one for No, I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. Completely. No, I did not do that. You should have been doing a duo metal with the moon. Yeah, but now I had to plug in my PC and my headset. I had to have an application detected and everything. And it says, uh, use the link in my enable it. It will not link to the link. Grand Cathedral! Grand Cathedral! I'm my advisor. I can't go with it. I can't believe you killed Tails. That was so. Why, why, why wouldn't I? The grandest cathedral ray ever. He was innocent, you, you insolent fuck. Yeah, but he's worthless. He's worthless. Who is Tails? Are we talking about. We're talking about. What does he look like? Yes. There's only one Tails. One. What will the mother do? Um, Super Mario Mario Grand, Grand Cathedral, Cathedral Ray. Ray. See? What he said. Oh, man. Grand Cathedral Ray. Yeah, you can't. Clasp its hands together as if in prayer. Yeah, I, An I enemy realize. charges and I, swings at her head. Prayers are locked. The giant sword different. hits only it's air as the after image fades in place. The soldier looks up to witness his now airborne foe encased uh. in a golden ether vortex. The mother's heart beats with the warrior's song. The wings stretch wide. She prays only to herself for the strength to save her daughter. The metal hands open toward all that would harm her angel, and she answers her own prayer with divine retribution unto the entire Grey Army. All enemies destroyed. Ether oh. amplifier charge oh, increased by 25%. 100%. 100%. Why are you saluting? Travelers, your attention, please. Yeah. The destruction fills the outposts with smoke. While we wait for the smoke to clear, let's exit the magenta mech this way. So. Whoa! So the line has been changed Man, from smoky out here. Continue fighting. <laughs> I really <laughs> love oh, the dude. line. She answers her own prayer <laughs> with divine retribution. <laughs> Who <Yeah. laughs> Perfect. Very sexy. <gasps> uh, I'm gonna absorb its green ether. I'm pretty sure that won't have any negative repercussions. What's that? You should fear the consequences. Yeah. Yeah. I suppose the story continues. With the wreckage of shredded and melted steel at its feet, the magenta mech stands tall, ready to shake the heavens. And the heavens do shake as a fiery red beam strikes down from the clouds. She narrowly dodges it as the surrounding area is annihilated. She looks up through the smoke to witness the abominable airship finally show itself. She stands ready to face the dark monument.
suddenly, an alarm goes off in the cockpit. Warning. Phase space logic rewrite detected. Class 7 anomaly approaching at extreme speed. What? What now? The mother questions. Another ship? Not the Dark Monument? This ether reading is impossible. The mother turns to check on her daughter. Safe. Asleep. What's happening? My friends, before the sun rises, let's join the daughter in a new dream. Oh. Please. I, uh, new dream? Alright. Oh my god. Let's go! Let's do it! Yes! Yes! Oh, there it is! Oh, I'm sorry. Hey! Hey, don't yeah. go past the plane! I knew it all along! I hate the letter I! Dominance, everybody, do not stop, 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 Back, back, back. Mark, do what? Just in a minute. Just missing you to sleep. Oh, I hate the line. I. No. <sighs> oh, it's not, <laughs> it's not an eye, it's... Nick, oh, beautiful. It's like a big L. Yeah, that is. You can teleport past the line. Okay. Yeah, that's not actually an eye. Oh. Okay. Oh, my God. My friends. Did we all die? The figure feels the ground rise to their feet. Their sense, senses come together one by one. Aware once again, a warm light greets their eyes. The shine splits the darkness. The figure steps into it, and the cold void quietly falls away. My friends, let's follow the figure into the light. This way. It's the undertale uh, door. Ran a little too early, but... No, not undertale. Hey, we can no, warn the others to not the approach the heart. The because it will glitch You're and they will get teleported. You're not quite the heart either, as I found out the hard way. <laughs> oh, Don't look, click the heart. Nice. Do not click, do not the, click the, the heart. Door. Do, not do not click on the door. Stay do not click on the door. Do not click on the door. I don't want to do an accident. Don't do it. Listen quick. If you just walk up to the party, you're you telling me to. Action. I was gonna do it anyway. No, no, no one yeah, clicked the door. It's bathed under sacred white light. The figure's mind struggles to understand the infomorphic structure, perceiving it as a gate. Waiting patiently nearby is the familiar, shimmering heart. Its colors friendly, innocent, wholesome. The gate opens, and the heart flutters through. The figure follows. I was first. I'd like this to be known that I was Undertale. first. Undertale. Sit still. No, we are in a dark room. You are acting like you are a YouTube commenter. Shh. Shh, 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 shh. It's very dark in here. Geo, YouTube commenter confirmed. My friends, this place, the figure thinks while placing their hand on a metallic wall. They don't finish the thought, and they quickly move through to explore this way. I'm gonna let myself onto you. <gasps> I'm gonna I'm gonna follow the cube because I have a bad feeling. What happened? 
I'm gonna fall tight to the cue's back. Is it the back or is it the front? Hmm? Praise the or cue. Or <laughs> This is not the yes. Mold. Yes. Right. You can never it's walking this way. If it's walking straight, then that's got to be forward for it. Yeah, walk this way. It's, it's going no, downwards. It's going backwards. Down. 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 It's going like this. It's moonwalking. Uh, I'm gonna go fast and moonwalking. We took the long hey. left when we should have took on the oh. right. Whoa. Da, da, da. Wow. Uh, 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 the breakfast bar. Oh, wait, no, we gotta wait for the power to go on to go to the breakfast bar. What the fuck? Really? Oh, I, I can see you got through. Okay, who's shooting? Yeah, I can see you. Everyone shoot. Who is shooting up nope. the place? No guns, people. We don't. The, the, the Shh, guns. We are I do right. know this. I know this so well. Oh, I was, I was hallucinating this for months. I know exactly. Muffy, have you not quick, we need to get to the breakfast maker. I do a little hallucinating. Quick, fight the puppet once again. You guys can trust me with the controls. No, we can not. Can we now? I have a bad feeling. Ah, no, hey, hey, that cute. Stop, stop are shooting the controls. <sighs> If you don't see their avatar, you don't see them shooting. I do. Yeah, fine, Dragir will touch the controls, even though I won't piano. make it go kablooey. Wait, no, stop, stop! You're gonna make it go kablooey doing it like that! Do it! No. Keep doing it. Yo, yo. Fun. We're trying to get the good ending, captain not the worst cameo? ending. Do we get a captain cameo? No, I'm gonna leave the, the lobby. Best ending. Hello? It's probably gonna be a cup of swag? Of coffee. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Nazi uh, button pusher. This is why we don't have to play. Because, you know. Here we go, the moment of truth. This is definitely not the good ending. The story continues. Oh my god, hi. I know, this is the one that I have to pay. Oh, something to ask Mommy. I'll be waiting the figure now. enters the heart of this space. A powerful engine sleeps before them. I've been here. I've seen this room alive. Right. Their eyes focus on a slot at the center of the console. Still carrying the ether crystal, they hold it up, looking into it. For the first time, the figure sees their own reflection. It's the good thing to do, she says, and places the orange crystal into the engine. Her heart beats once. She remembers. Ba bum. Her heart beats once. The engine ignites. Ba bum. Ba bum. Her heart beats once. She notices her flight suit. Ba bum. Her heart beats once. She remembers the legend. Ba bum. Once upon a time, there was an invincible vessel. From the depths, it rises. Over the oceans, it shines. Through the skies, it soars. Manifesting through 10,000 stories made real, the legendary ship comes true, and the pilot dashes to the bridge. Travelers, this way. Hey guys, uh, all hands, all hands report yeah, to the bridge. Yeah, I want another number one. All hands report to the bridge for battle. Report to the breakfast 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 breakfast. I gotta stop there at least once. I gotta see. Oh no. Can stop by the duty free? Oh, uh, it happened there. Make it sure happened there. I know it. I know it. Get a snack at the breakfast oh, bar. You haven't already. Get the fucking. Ah! Uh, uh, breakfast it. bar. What if we yeah, were all in the elevator? Breakfast bar. You guys make sure to get a healthy snack at the breakfast bar. I got it. 
Yeah. And remember, kill all your enemies. enemies. And, and, and feast on their blood. I don't know why, but I can't remember the name. What is the name of the ship? Idrisil. Idrisil, thank you. Is, would this be Idrisil 1 or 2? What do you mean? Uh, in Xenogears, there was there was an Idrisil 2. I don't remember. Probably, probably whichever one is better. There. No, don't drink the mouth. We're going to the hawk, by the way. I'm air chairing everywhere to assert dominance. It's still broken for you. I'm deeper air chairing. Yeah, no, this lobby has been broken for a while now for me. Yeah, someone needs to be active. This avatar can only air chair this movie. Ah, imagine getting muted. But I think you know what's gonna happen. Breakfast. Wow. This is breakfast. <laughs> no, you're not the only one. I think there's a few other people who are broken too. Yep. Quickly to the box. Travelers, gather around, take a seat, grab a control. The story continues. The mimetic sensors are set off as the travelers enter the bridge. Huh? What? Someone on my ship? Anomalies on the bridge? Where? I don't see anyone. The sensors say, all around me. Oh. The travelers, it's you, isn't it? Let's see. If I increase the amp range of the ether crystal... Hello? Travelers, can you hear me? You have a, a very well stuffed breakfast the bar. Wacky, wiggly crew. Quite lovely. Yes, I can hear you. There are so many of you. You really were with me, watching over this whole time. I knew you were real. Thank you all so much. I'm no the pilot. Welcome to my legendary ship. Okay, travelers, it's about time I got a crew, so listen up. There's a brave little girl out there who needs us. A real nasty thing known as the Dark Monument is making a mess of their world. I made a promise as a pilot that I can't let things like that fly. And I think all of you travelers did too. So how about it? Will you be my crew for the legendary ship? Mm -hmm. Absolutely! Absolutely. 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 And equalization. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, sorry, We're gonna take these guys down and have some breakfast. So they killed you equalization, shit? then. You talking? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, we are frenemies. What do you expect? <laughs> right. <laughs> All right, crew. We're gonna blast that monster out of the sky. Fasten your seatbelts and grab a plate yeah. of breakfast. Prepare for takeoff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's time to fly. Yeah. <laughs> yes, man. The line is now canon. Oh, yes. And so the battle begins. Where my seatbelt? Hey, hey you man, what song is this? Do you happen to know? Oh, this is cool. You thought it was the legend? The you thought it was the, the Dark Mementos? When it was... Out. Let's jump off and oh, yeah. land. In case anyone Super forgot. Well, well, well. We love we jump in the That ship over there. This is the back. Eh, I or prefer front. Wait, no, this is the front. Fuck you! Yeah, this, this is the is front. The front. The bow? Captain Bobby! What do we do? You thought it was the Dark... Monument? Hi! The dark wall. Yeah, the dark wall. Travelers, gather around the story. The dream continues. Alright, I need to put the thing... The legendary ship flies high and true, closing in on the outpost. In a thunderous flyby, the pilot fires on the Grey Army. Accepting the challenge, the dark ship of terror rises from the clouds and gives chase. And thus, travelers, your final battle, airship versus airship, begins. The pilot shouts out, Travelers, are you ready to fly? 
Yes! Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh I've seen a thing or two about airships in my day, I think. Oh, God. Is that a lot of homework? You don't need to be scared of the heights. It's the falling that you do. Right. Everyone took your traveler's chat. That was very quiet to be directed towards everyone. Everyone took your traveler's chat. These are the answers to the airship. Yeah. Let's do this. Gaming. I don't feel like he would be a good person. Gaming. He's a robot. Yeah, that's a bang one. Hmm. Oh, oh, uh, uh oh! Oh no! Oh no! That's oh, really bad. Oh, no. That's horrible. Oh, no. Wait, where's Trey? Oh, no. Where's Trey? Oh, no. Where's Trey? Ah oh, no. oh, no. oh, man! No! Please don't panic. Sheen is on his way. He's reloading the world. Please don't panic. panic. Everything is under control. Wow, there's been a lot of panic. 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 Touch my butt. Require the strongest oh, yeah. wills. You know, well, this was truly unexpected, huh? I did not Who's flashy? You can't stand on the cannons. It's bound to happen from time to time. As I say, you're not a cult if you're a chaos. It's the boy, yeah. Oh, that's how it's going, you know? The battle begins. Let's do this. Alright. Let's do this. 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 Let's Yes, My friends, you know, your know, attention, know, please. The Traveler. Yeah. The pilot has the following option. Fire torpedo. Fire ether cannon. Evasive maneuvers. Charge up the ether amplifier. Heavy artillery. And overdrive yeah. shift. What Heavy will the pilot artillery. do? Fire Heavy artillery. artillery. Heavy artillery. Heavy artillery. Heavy artillery. Heavy artillery. Heavy artillery. Correct answer. I just called it. Blow that Heavy artillery, so that's what they call me. I have heard the group. Out of the sky! Oh god, I don't know why. The dark, heavy artillery. Opens fire with its heavy guns, no, and the like right legendary now, ship counterattacks with heavy artillery cannons. Fire at will. Fuck you, artillery. Who is Will? Who is Will? Ah, yeah. Good firebolt, Joey. Oh, okay. The dark monument takes heavy damage. Yeah, that's right. Nice try. What's your next move, Dark Monument. Did you get it? Good. Oh, okay. I'm behind. Oh, God. Your retreat behind me. This way, friends. Behind us. Yeah. Exit view. Anything but the real. Yeah. Yeah. To the back, friends. To the back. They think they can look up my skirt. Jokes on them. Oh fuck no. Oh. Oh, not again. Oops. The dark monument moves toward the stern, trailing behind the legendary ship. The pilot has 30 seconds to choose. Fire torpedo. Fire ether cannon. 
No. Evasive maneuvers. No. Charge the no. ether amplifier. Overdrive shift. No. Overdrive shift. Overdrive shift. Oh overdrive God. shift. Shift it into overdrive. Oh, shift it into maximum overdrive. Oh, oh. You're approaching me. Maximum overdrive. I have heard the group speak in unison. Overdrive shift. Yes. This is correct. Aye, aye, aye Captain the dark this monument Put her in reverse, Terry. To ram the stern. <laughs> But is met with explosive oh. fire from the legendary ship's thrusters. You'll never catch me, Dark Monument. Not when I shift Get into maximum you overdrive. Yeah. <laughs> Scorch that thing! I knew it was a wise idea. <laughs> nice try! Oh, we shot on the fire. Back to the smell. We need to go. That way. Watch out. Insects. Yeah, the giant robots freeze. I mean, another character is right. I mean, who knows if they can see us? Either Empire may not be that strong, but I'm gonna see us. I don't think you. Fire torpedo. Oh, oh, I can't 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 maneuvers. Charge yeah. the ether amplifier. What will the pilot do? Evasive maneuvers. Evasive maneuvers. Evasive maneuvers. I'm gonna sum this one up by saying we're mega fucked. Can I hear this one, please? Can I please? Evasive maneuvers. That's a strike. We will read them the first chapter of Wu Baby. Of course. I was saying I could. Oh, now, I can't the answer, see, sorry. Well, got it. The answer is a basic maneuver, but, or as I like to call it, a barrel roll. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we're not gonna fall off the roof. Oh my god. 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 My friends, well, in this case, it might be if you suffer from motion sickness, please close your eyes for the next 20 seconds. The legendary uh, ship executes a barrel roll to avoid <laughs> yeah, it from the fire from below. Peppy would be oh, I haven't seen this in VR yet. Here we go. I can do this standing on one leg. Okay, it's a little tough to stand on one leg through the whole thing. But I did it. I believe everyone's still on the ship. I'm sick. I think he's gonna go. Artificial light. Oh, we're we're gonna get a half robot. Prepare so, fat. You miss. Travelers, the this. dark monument goes silent, showing no change in flight path. Yeah. All right. What will the pilot do? Fire a torpedo. Fire ether cannon. Charge the ether amplifier. Yes. Charge the ether amplifier. Charge the ether amplifier. Charge the ether amplifier. Charge the ether amplifier. Baby. Ether oh, amplifier. Amplifier that ether. My spine! Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> what? A red spine! <laughs> <laughs> Protect the briefcase! Red, red, red spies on the base! I have heard the group say, oh, Charge the ether amplifier. Yes! Yes! yes. Charge the ether amplifier! It's beautiful. Sir, what, what the Seizing the opportunity to redirect power, the pilot charges the ether amplifier. Just after she presses the button, she is hit with a sudden mimetic attack, which knocks her away from the helm. She quickly recovers and takes back the wheel. The amp is now charged. Amp it up. Amp it up. That's a good robot voice. That is Peter voice. Two. Ether amplifier fully charged. Calling out to the travelers. Ether amplifier fully charged. Guys, you can hear the pilot. Travelers.
Zed. Yes. Mommy? Howdy. I mean, pilot? Hello? Listen, yes. I need your help. The sensors are picking up troops mobilizing inside the dark monument. Intruder alert. They are going to try boarding us. Intruder alert. I can divert power to the ether crystal's field effect for 60 seconds. I won't be able to move the ship, but it should be enough for you to interact with this narrative. Be brave, travelers, and fight. I believe in you. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Controllers. Turn off my boo womp inhibitors. Oh. <laughs> I'm the best. You think you can attack me? <laughs> Who the fuck is talking Take to set up Kaiba voice? Alright, all I have left is a mech to take out. Okay, no more back there. The travelers defeat the troops and successfully protect the legendary I ship. Not a calling off. Hmm, recovered. Just mega water? sacrifice. Oh, like okay. Travelers, Fire this way. Fire the Tortinos! I mean the torpedoes! Yes. Yes. Fire the Tortinos! Fire the Tortinos! Fire the Tortinos again! No! Fire the Tortinos! Tortinos again! Tortino Tortinos! Fire Tostitos! Tortinos! Um, Doritos! Fire the Torpedoes! Fire the Tortinos! I mean the overhead, now port side of the legendary ship. The pilot. Has the following options to choose from: fire torpedo, fire <laughs> ether cannon. What will the pilot do? Send them the pizza rolls in the torpedoes. Get him out of the torpedo. He is a weapon of mass destruction. I am the weapon of mass. See, I am the weapon of mass destruction. It was me all along. I'm actually made of tostinos. So we throw you at the ship. Travelers, I have heard you speak once again in unity. I beg of your silence. I have heard you speak in unity. Fire torpedo. Is this correct? Yes. With torpedoes. Uh, yes. 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 Send them a gift with cheese. Well, yes, but actually no. Throw a torpedo. The pilot Black American fires a torpedo. On the torpedo. Well, pretty guy. Send it. You know what they call me. Prepare. Let's see if it desyncs a lot. Oh no. Behold. Oh no. There we go. Boom. 
Big purple. Look at that JPEG go. Guys. Torpedo Jim. Oh, Torpedo Jim. That is a That's nice fire. That's some explosive diarrhea. That's actually the end of the talk about. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happened. It's gonna be nice. C4 with a blue burrito. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, guys. <laughs> the dark monument takes heavy damage. <laughs> Don't go anywhere, guys. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. I believe we have Ethan Kane. We got one more spot and it's up here again. Yep, everyone remain. Like call us Uber Eats. We're delivering remain. you Taco Bell. Taco Bell directly to your own house. I hope the ship's name is Uber Eats. <laughs> Damn, it's showing its ass at us. Oh, it's like, look what you did! <laughs> the dark monument suddenly falls behind before rocketing past the, the bow, nearly colliding with the legendary <laughs> ship. The bow? The pilot only has 30 seconds and one option remaining. Fire the ether cannon. Let's do it. Fire. Travelers, do yeah. fire do the ether cannon. Yeah. Yeah. Fire yes. 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 Allow me to say this. Travelers, silence. And in place of your shenanigans, I will place another shenanigan. At this time, I would like you all, kindly, if you would be so kind, to together do a Kamehameha chant. I just made a call of a freaking You are hit like yeah, no. The moment of truth. All right. Okay. 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 I'm gonna oh, shit my pants. Shit, that's a giant cannon. Where did you fit in there? Oh, the no. story continues. Sci fi bullshit. That's how. The dark no, it's monuments. Mad. Mech fleet suddenly appears and surrounds the legendary ship. Soon, an enormous ether cannon emerges from, the be from below the dark ship's deck. Blocked on all sides, the pilot is unsure what to do. Travelers, you have one minute to answer the open question. Anything is valid. What will the pilot do? Call 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 just wait. Call me and tell her we're scared and open you. Can't wait for all the new people, dear man. Dominate. Mommy. Home cooking mama. Call the magenta man. Actually, the answer. Call the magenta man. That is yes. Listen to the rat. Listen to the rat. Okay, Maybe mind. have can them. Uh, can call? we? Can we like send? Please just call the mother. Their way and then have them use the extra energy to 
to fucking hit no, him again? No, we just a deer. Amber, call call, call the mother. We, we, guys, okay. we already know the answer. Call the mother, call the mother please. That is the yeah. answer. Call, call, call the mother. Call, call the mother. Call the mother. The school bus didn't pick us up. Call mother. The school bus didn't pick us up. Call mother. Yes, call mother. Mom, I missed the bus again. Call mother. Travelers, kindly remain silent. L Luna, what will the pilot do? Luna, call your mom. mom. <laughs> What do you want to do? You want to call the mother? Yeah. Call the mother. Wait, I say the mother says to call the mother. Oh calling the mother? Luna is ahead of the moment. Luna is ahead of most of the class here. She has a real mother there. She has a confirmation from a real mother. Travelers, the story continues. Wake Trusting the travelers, yeah. the pilot radios a distress you. signal to mother. The signal connects. Calling the lone mech pilot fighting the gray army. The this lone is the mech resistance pilot. ship engaged with the dark monument. Do you copy? I am surrounded by the aerial units requesting your urgent support. Do you copy? I repeat, I am surrounded by the Dark Monument's aerial fleet. Please assist. There's no answer. But the pilot can hear nervous breathing. I repeat, this is... This is the pilot of the legendary <laughs> ship. From the story your daughter dreams of. I know she is asleep in the back seat. I know you are afraid, and that you only want to protect her. Listen, I know this sounds impossible, but your daughter has the power to manipulate probability, even reality. You know this is true. Her hope was strong enough to make her dream real, to create life, and bring me into your world. I have her memories of the pilot she loved. Memories of past adventures, other worlds she's surely told you about. She has called me to save you. I've nearly defeated this monster, but I need your help. The next words are spoken together by both the pilot and the daughter in her sleep. Mama, please help me. Finally, the mother speaks. Why should I help you? The sudden reveal of the mother's voice stuns the pilot, and she goes silent. The mother's voice is heard again. I don't know how you know about my daughter or why you would say such things. But if what you say is true, why should I help you? It's Travelers, it's how it's will the pilot the answer break. mother? You have one minute to search your heart. Because it is the good yeah. thing to do. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Chance it is the oh, good thing to do. We're absolutely certain it's it's that's the phrasing of it, right? Yes. yes. It's the good Travelers. thing to do. I have heard I you speak yet again in unity. I swear to God. I'm having many and the story will right continue now. as such. The pilot answers. I am your daughter as she hopes to be just as you and just as you and daddy taught me i'll always help people because because it's the good thing to do a moment passes 
and the pilot holds her breath as she watches the radio. The mother speaks. Angel? Mama's coming to save you. Oh my goodness. Yo, let's go. Let's go. It actually happened. It bloody well happened. Oh my god, robotic, look. I know it's punching him out. Like, <laughs> yo, Mike Tyson? <laughs> yeah, Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson? Punch out, bro. Mike Tyson? The mother's Mike Tyson. Yeah, Bruh, too. I'd love for her to RKO me if you know what I mean. If it was Mike Tyson, no, bad. Be the, the life thing to <laughs> Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Let's go. We've done it. We've bloody well done it. Let's go. No, let's wait for the grand finale if they actually could destroy the actual. Oh, baby, a triple. <laughs> no, no. Yes. <laughs> Let's go. It's exactly in our What's she doing? What's she doing? What's she doing? What's she doing? Oh, oh my god. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, 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 is that the cathedral, Is that the cathedral, Ray? Is that the cathedral, it's a CD! It's a CD! Okay, burn, motherfuckers! Let it out, DR mode. It's finally over. The path was traumatizing. I'll say that for oh, sure. She's making sure they are extra crispy. Well done. <laughs> See you never, you fucking bastards. Bye bye. Bye bye. That's what you get. Dumbass. Have a nice trip. See you next fall. Well, hey, Dad, goodbye. Surprise! Oh, I am going to collect that. Surprise! Oh, surprise! We have one. We got breakfast from you. Gift shop, and then you're able to. They should get a keychain for the air. What does that sound? I've never been more glad than you. That was just a kind of explosion. Oh, Mama's Mama fine. Damn. Travelers, your attention please. The story concludes. Still yelling, even waiting them. You see him does the work. Go us! There's still more. And go mom. The Grey Waited. Army's most powerful weapon, its flagship, goes down in flames as a massive monument of hope seen across the sky for miles. My friends, please use the whole save point.
The whole save point. Oh, oh this is so good. You should have broken. Wait a minute. Wait. Oh, how many months? Fucking Paul. Oh, oh man. It's orange. It's orange. No, that's it's a red. red. It's, 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 red. it's, it's a red. It's a red. It's a red. Whoa. Nice. Oh. What? What? Dude, this is crying. 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 Dude, this I don't think I want to know that somewhere on me for fly. Travelers, gather around. Anyway. There you go. Travelers, gather around where you can hear. Yeah, but you can't fall if you're flying. I'm gonna take a shower. The magenta mech <laughs> cruises steadily over the clouds. <laughs> The sky is calm and clear. The mother looks back to see her daughter slowly blinking as the light shines over her sleepy eyes. Mama? M Mama? Mama, where is the pilot? She's here. I dreamed you were with her. I know, Angel. The mother says calmly. I know. The daughter scrambles out of her seat and over to her mother's lap. There, she looks over the clouds to the horizon, her hopeful eyes searching from left to right. Where is she? Why can't I see her ship? Suddenly, the console signals an incoming transmission. The mother looks at the blinking light. Is it her? Is it her, Mama? The mother checks the sky. Empty and clear. She slowly presses the button, accepting the connection. Survivors, calling for survivors. I repeat, this is the Ethos Coalition Search and Rescue Party. A transport has been dispatched within this region. Calling for survivor survivors. I repeat, this is the Ethos Coalition Search and Rescue Party. We, we are alive, the mother answers. We hear you. Transports are landing on the coastline at the Great Forest Edge. Can you make it there? That won't be necessary. I will fly to you. Uh, fly, ma'am, are you piloting something? We have reports the Dark Monument was destroyed. Was that your vessel that took it down? No, it... The daughter interrupts. It was the pilot and the legendary ship. Together with Mama, they stopped that bad monster. The mother motions for her daughter to be quiet. Ma'am, you've saved this entire region. Whatever you're piloting, I'm getting orders to lead you directly to Ethos HQ. Sending coordinates to you now. Why is your location up in the sky? Are you scrambling my scanners? Ma'am, wait. This is how to survive the gray. These are coordinates to the aerial city Shavat. <gasps> what? Hey, yo. Oh, whoa. oh, Shavat. What? The painter too. Wait, the painter too. The painter too. <laughs> yes. Yo. Are we angel eyes? Contacts. Oh. The daughter holds her mother's hand <laughs> and nods. Shavat. Shavat, Mama, that's where I have to go. Having finally found a safe refuge, they fly off to the sky's horizon. Hey, uh, yo. Wave we well, goodbye, everyone. Happy Wave trails. I hope we can bring that back to the picture. <laughs> yeah. Farewell, Mama. Yeah.
No, we have well, to go to the still getting back now. We get to replay through the whole game. <laughs> There's no save yeah. game. Save state I lost. Like okay. Oh, wait! Oh, hey, guys. Oh! 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 Travelers. Oh my god, hi. I'm afraid I'm fading. But I want to give you something as thanks for not giving up and never losing hope for her. Indeed. I won't be needing this anymore. Oh, oh no, what? Oh, is she giving what I think oh. she's giving us? She's giving us, oh. Oh. No. She's giving us the ether grid. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm not him. Oh, don't worry, I, I, wow. Oh, don't worry, guys, I'm happy orange crystal. I think I'm happy orange crystal. I think we need a group people to do this. Come on, quickly. I know what our picture's gonna be. This thing is a pretty good alternate to the picture. I just see the runners. The users are going to blow up. Travelers, listen carefully. Travelers, these crystals are strange things. They exist in multiple planes at the same time. They're outside of normal time. When I look into this crystal, I see a message on a wall of a room somewhere. I don't know what it means, but I know I was supposed to read it to you. It says... Raise your glass to sacred names in narratives we love and the door of trust will open through old numerology you were just typing that crazy it's <laughs> over it's nice finally right there over. <laughs> that was not easy that family went through a lot you all went through a lot but as long as we don't give up, there is always hope. You mustn't ever give up, travelers. Well, we will. I'm off to a new adventure. Don't worry. Hope we I know again. we will meet again. The good thing to do. Exactly. Oh, it is the good that. thing to do to we meet again. Uh, My friend Kyra agrees. See you, space cowboy. Oh, man. My friends, oh. welcome. To the true nowhere. ending of the pilot. Yeah. Yes. 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 I thought Luigi was there. Bye, brothers and sisters. We got the true ending. Put your hands together for tonight's NPCs, Wario and Waluigi. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna get so much breakfast. Thank you. This is drunk over at at Sheen's bar. Well, we Travelers. also have to give a big huge <laughs> round of applause to the guy who hosted the whole thing. Like, narration and all. Thank you, Sheen. We are not a cult. We are not a cult. We are my favorite insane. cult. My friends, yeah, exactly. thank you so very much for going through this story over and over again. The frustration that we felt built up the necessary emotional inertia to arrive at where we are today. I've watched you all joke and laugh and and even sing and dance together as we walked through this world many times. You've all made a lot of friends. And my push to talk button 
has kept me silent, but I was there laughing with you. <laughs> My friends. So we did meet him laugh. We never have an after party. And, and, oh, right. It wouldn't be fair to my Good team photo. and all the work they put into this if I don't mention this. My friends, mm -hmm. if you like the work that we do, and you want to help us fund world builders and commissions for these projects, we have a Patreon. Mm -hmm. The link to it is in the info channel of our Discord. And the Discord mm -hmm. ID is my status in VR chat. Please forfeit all mortal possessions to the cube. <laughs> now, picture time. How about a commemorative photo? Do we have a photographer among us? Uh, I, I know where we should do it. Bring, bring back the mech with the crystal. Bring back the mech with the crystal. The crystal. That should be our photo spot. Let's all, let's all stand around the ether crystal of hope. Can you bring yeah, the mech take back? Take a photo yes. together. Can you bait the, bring the mech back too? Oh, yeah. I think there's one more thing. Easier. Oh, apologies, I can't. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Who uh, says we need height? Yeah, the crystal is much better. <laughs> the first one was. Yeah. Sorry for anyone. I don't know what the first one was. No. It's amazing. You don't believe what I've been going through. Aside from everyone else. I do want the camera. Who's setting up the camera? Right, right, I don't have the will this to keep the camera. Oh, wait, that's that's right. Right. Yeah, that works. That's. I actually can't see past. Wait, 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 I am very happy right now. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Oh my. Purple table. Dizzy. Humble. Right, Yee. Countdown for us. Okay, I'm gonna this is correct. Uh, <laughs> wait, what are we it's saying? I'm an arbitrary. What are we saying? We are saying it's the good thing to do. 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 Yeah. It's the good thing to do. 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 I hope my face was right. <laughs> You are relieved, aren't you? It's been so long. It's finally over, man. We finally got the good ending. We finally shut that thing out of the sky. I think I'm starting to be able to tell what's going to be happening in the future. It's been almost a year in the making. This is this is literally. I have a feeling that your travelers is literally turning into a chaos emerald hunt for the ether crystals. Travelers, your attention, please. Travelers, travelers, your attention, please. In exactly one minute, I will open the door to the after party. In exactly one minute, I will open the door to the after party. That's my that's my cue to leave right. and come back. Oh yeah, that's my well, cue to go in and gather my supplies. I'm mixing up my own fuzzy dice. Are you being fried?